Hey, what's going on YouTube? What's up, my buttholes and my vagina buttholes? <laughs> I don't know. That's, I'm trying to. I'm trying this new thing where like. <clears throat> Sorry, I'm like a little sick, but I'm trying this new thing where I'm gonna call the guys out there who's watching my vlogs the buttholes because guys we have buttholes. <laughs> as, as silly and stupid as it sounds, and I'm gonna call the girls vagina buttholes because you have a vagina and you have a butthole. Combo breaker, bitch. <laughs> but uh, I'm just chilling right now in my room. It's I didn't make the vlog for Saturday, but I'm gonna tell you guys for this vlog considering I was pretty much updating you guys lately, and I really didn't update you guys all the time, and I didn't have <laughs> I was I was mostly distracted at uh, making vlogs lately. So I hope you guys forgive me for that. But I was talking to this girl. And uh, yeah, this, this is this is how it's gonna start off. Um, my sound off or some weird, but I mean, I, I I think personally, like I like her, like because she's really interesting. <laughs> but um, before I get into that, what happened Saturday? Pretty much, my voice is like low right now. But uh, what happened Saturday was, um, I woke up at like two p.m. I think I think I woke up at two p.m. That. Not the band, not Korean boy band 2 p.m., but you get my point. But, uh, I was, um, going to the mall, and I was shopping, and I pretty much, as you, if you watched my fashion channel, you'll see that I bought, um, a Tupac hoodie. Sorry about that. By the way, this is gonna be no cuts and no edits, so that's the reason why I don't really, like, cut a lot of things. So, yeah. But, um, I was shopping at H&M. And some some days I'm really nice, some days I'm not, but this particular day, um, usually when it comes to like discounts, I'm for discounts, like I don't really care, so I'll just take it. But um, my mom gave me the two coupons with 30% off, and I met the, I was in the line, and I, could, I can use my 30% on the clothing, and I can use it to 30% again, but uh, I just didn't use it so i actually gave one away to this uh black guy behind me i was just being nice i was just like here you, maybe you can use it as well and here we go the text start going in so you guys can see that <laughs> but uh i'm sorry if i don't uh respond i'm just uh texting uh her and when i mean by her i mean by dawn uh she's really interesting in my in my view and i just want to know her more pretty much but I, Saturday was pretty good though. I mean, I didn't really expect too much out of that day. But in the end, I actually was like happy that I actually went to the mall. I went to the mall, ate some sushi. I was walking around the mall. My mall, I live near a mall, but I also go to a different mall. So I went to a different mall and then I went to H&M. Then I got my Tupac hoodie. Now here's the thing, I don't even, I didn't really expect Tupac to be like, that big of an inspiration to me considering I found out who he was until I was a junior in high school and that was because my history teacher made me listen made the whole class listen to um Tupac but um I'm gonna hold up like cut it because I don't want it to be that long <laughs> sorry about that guys I was pretty much just texting the whole time but uh this I'm gonna do this I'm gonna just cut the video when it comes to texting her and then I'll just uh move on with what I'm gonna say so yeah, that's pretty much it. <laughs> um, and I've been, and here's the thing, uh, who she is, uh, she goes by Dawn, she's 18 years old, uh, she's from California, and, uh, we actually met through Tumblr, um, it, she just, <clears throat> I think I messaged her, or she messaged me, and then it, we just started to Skype, and then it just led one thing to another, and <laughs> that's pretty much <laughs> really what, what, hap what happened. And, I mean, I, I really <laughs> don't regret one thing about it, considering she does really make me happy. Because um, I, I wouldn't say, like, I'm really infatuated with her, but, like, like I like her. Like, I guess, like, crush on her, considering, like, she... Everything about her is really what I like, what and what, what I like and what I wanted in a girl. Because, um, like... When you're on Skype, you pretty much, like, talk to each other 
kind of like you're talking to each other on the camera but like you notice more small things about them um, even though you're not in person you can still get the gist of who they are and when we first chatted on Skype like she thought <laughs> she thought she thought I was um a pedophile <laughs> and I'm I'm not it's just like I look really young I'm 19 and she I was like what because <laughs> she actually met some like stalkers on the internet before so that's pretty much why she was like uh, cautious about it but she was the one who gave me her skype in the first place i didn't ask so yeah i was talking to don pretty much for the whole i think three four days so far um i just really want to get to know her pretty much a lot more considering there's really a lot of things that i like about her okay so um she plays video games now in my view, I love a girl who can play video games because you don't see a lot of girls with their, like, if you talk to a, bo a girl and a guy and they're like boyfriend and girlfriend, and you ask them, do, they, do the girl play the video games as well with the guy or not, or something like that, most of the time girls really don't, in my view, they don't really, sorry, they don't partake into their boyfriend's interest because they feel like it should be, that's his thing and then this is my thing, which is, in my view, is bad. When you're in a relationship, you should take interest in each other's interest if that makes sense actually that makes sense because you want to get comfortable enough when they're doing their own thing and they're happy with what they do and if you're happy when you're there then they shouldn't have a problem because they're your significant other but um regarding to dawn uh she's a filipina she um she's going to university i think or was it in college she's in college same as me and she's in the, gonna be in the philippines and um i think it's after one week was it i think it's like one week after i think th after this week that ends then it's gonna she's gonna be going there because she's dorming but uh i i think i think really a lot for some reason about her i don't I don't mean it to be like in an uncomfortable, creepy way, because I, I just, I guess, like her a lot, <laughs> and if, and I put in the effort to actually, like, talk to her, it's not like I talk to her and she actually does, like, chase after, it's just that I chase, <laughs> pretty much, but, um, when it came to talking and Skyping with each other, like, if you guys ever been in that kind of situation because i'm pretty sure most people out there if they're like on social networking site or like either on facebook tumblr twitter um they get to have a sense of like t they want to talk to this person to see if they really are who they are when it comes to even like tumblr or something like that or twitter like if you talk to like your followers or your like your viewers on youtube and um on tumblr you want to get to know them more if really they interest you and that's pretty much what I like about knowing Dawn in my view because she's really beautiful and she's really pretty and I mean I just really want to get to know her a lot more and I don't I'm not saying like I want to be in a relationship but like it's like a crush pretty much and I don't really know how this will end up but I can tell that I'm gonna enjoy really talking to her a lot often and when she's because i know she's gonna be in the philippines and in the philippines you don't have internet as much like they don't have wi-fi where she's gonna be at so but they have like internet cafes so i was actually trying to like schedule to see what times she's available so we can actually have time to talk so <laughs> which was really um she took notice of that because she was like oh that's sweet um, and it's true because like I want to talk to her so I'm gonna I'm gonna put I'm gonna go out of my way to put in the effort and time to talk to her so that's pretty much w it is what it is and I mean I can't stress that enough but um generally though generally speaking in my most terms she's really a really fun person to be with really I love a lot of things about her like you, you notice something you mom you might not but for me i notice a lot of things that i keep i um i uh what do you call it i remember and it sticks with me uh, for example she smiles i mean it's just really cute in my view and 
it's something that I, I can't like when I look at her and I smile and this is on camera by the way because we're not we can't we don't see each other in person obviously so um when she smiles when I say a joke or something or um I try to be silly or I'm not even trying to be funny and she smiles I take notice and it's it's really cute and I really like that so I mean if you're you're like te technically like physically attracted to them and you want to get to know them more that's that's the thing like you don't have to be like a perfect 10 but like if in my view she's really beautiful and I mean some most guys would probably agree as well and some others might not because everyone has different tastes and they have they like different people obviously but um another thing that I noticed is that she fidgets a lot when she like like talks to me and she like moves around which is really cute in my view considering the way she does it it's, it's just like it kind of like captivates you in a way and you just want to smile pretty much <laughs> and that's pretty much what it came down to when it came to talking to her pretty much um, another thing when it came to the whole Skype thing is a uh, I got to know her in a in a way and um it, it's something that I shared like I talked to her a lot on Skype and I talked I text her still texting her at the moment but um it's a it's something that I just I guess I pursued because you really can't help who you like it's emotions that really do take into account you have to realize that because most people out there if if you look at a person and by the way i don't think it's really personality first before it looks considering when you look at somebody you're like physically attracted to them and then you later on get to know them because like once you say hi it's just like hey and then all that other stuff so i think the looks part first comes because think about it if you look at somebody from the street or something and you think they're attractive you're gonna if you're shy then you're not gonna go up to them but if you are confident enough then you'll go up to them say hi and you'll get to know them and yeah that's pretty much what I think about it and there's a lot of people out there who get into really in my view get into relationships are in it for the wrong reasons really um, if you guys didn't know I'm 19 years old uh, I'm a virgin and I am very contented towards myself and I don't I'm not a person who just fucking like fucks around and shit so that's pretty much why and I was for some odd reason when I was talking to her even though we met for like just a short amount of time I'm really I'm really open person if you talk to me and you want to get to know me I'll be really honest with you guys I'll be I don't care cuz it's honesty it's what's true it's not a lie it's the truth so I was really being honest with um I she told her she's gonna watch this video <laughs> and she's gonna be like yeah you told me I know <laughs> like that but um I was talking to her on Skype and I told her that I really like like I liked everything about her and she made me smile a lot and I'm happy that I'm talking to her pretty much so yeah and this video is gonna be damn this video is gonna be really long but um I don't really mind so I'm just gonna be talking to the camera the whole time but I hope you guys take into account of this whole thing because you're probably I think the viewers out there they're gonna be like oh he likes this girl it's gonna turn into a long distance relationship but I mean I don't really know okay because I'm I'm not putting my hopes up too much the thing is don't get your hopes up too much um because you never know what the outcome is but um I really do enjoy talking to Dawn because she's really beautiful and she's really pretty to me she's really cute she, she's like she's perfect in her own way and i take notice of the little things in my view when it comes to her um but it's it's something that i just can't like i i don't know why i just i think about it and i think about it i, I think i overthink situations a lot so that's pretty much why but um i was talking to her and we're still talking so yeah i mean when she goes to the Philippines, I really don't know what to expect. But I hope though me and her keep talking and conversating because I really don't want it to end at all. Um, and you you guys might be asking yourself like, Oh, he's probably thinking of long distance relationships or something like that. And the thing is, in my view, 
you have to be really committed. I'm a very, I'm open about it. So I'm a very committed person. When I like somebody and I will put in all my effort for that one person, no matter how stressful it might be, in the end, it's going to be worth it in my view. And the reason why you might ask myself, you might ask me like, why would you want to be in long distance relationships? That's really hard. I've been in one and it took a turn for the worst, but I moved on and I found this girl and it's interesting getting to know her really. And I don't care what you guys think. Any Anybody thinking negatively about this whole thing, I don't really care about your opinion because I really do just care about her and I like I want to see her just happy and knowing that I'm the one making her smile and she laughs a lot when I talk to her so yeah and my parents been in a long distance relationship for five years five year long years and it it got me thinking because if my dad can do it then I can do it as well so and by the way this was back then when they didn't have Skype they didn't have uh, Skype texting they only had phone calls so you got you have to take that to account really that's really really hard to deal with and my mom my mom and her friends back then they they also had long distance relationships but my mom and my dad was out of was the fewest and the rarest to actually come through all of that and in the end they're living together obviously they're taking care of (laughs) us the family and they're happy and that's what really matters the most Hold on a bit, I'm still texting her. (laughs) Hey guys, I'm back. Well, pretty much, pretty much the sum of the whole thing is we met through Tumblr and we kept on talking and then we just started to, I guess, just keep on talking. And I think it's a great thing because I really do want to get to know her and she also does want to get to know me more. So yeah, (laughs) but the thing is I talk a lot. She knows I talk a lot, so when I talk on like if I talk on camera obviously I talk so much about myself and then I just want it like she's gonna hear me out and I actually like it because she took she takes notice than most people they don't really like bother listening so um I'm happy though and that uh she does listen if you're wondering why I have a straw I have um maybe uh, Dunkin Donuts <laughs> can you guys do that like with the fingers like some people can do it like really fast but this is the only method I can do like you just twirl it around your fingers and shit kind of i don't think it's a talent but i think it's just something like weird that i had to like do when i was like in in, like middle school because like i would always be bored and i'd flick my fucking pen like (laughs) i'm waiting for the test i'm just like that but um that my i think it's like mocha or something dunkin donuts mocha it's iced coffee but um I don't mind coffee. I just don't drink a lot of coffee all the time. But when I do have it, I just like want more. <laughs> it's like I don't know. Mm. That shit's good. But <laughs> um, regarding on Do- regarding on um, Dawn, considering she- I know she's gonna watch this video. I said it twice, but um, she's really beautiful. I really think that, and I really think a girl like her deserves a guy to be honest and truthful with her and actually um give give her their all than just give them one part because um she she told she told me about like exes and all that um now you're not supposed to talk you don't really talk about exes when you're like obviously trying to talk to each other but um i'm a really open person so if a person asks me about something i won't i won't won't hesitate to to tell them what i what i know and what i do know is like okay I got bit fucking mosquitoes. They're fucking like biting me and shit. I mean, it's like red now. But uh, yeah, I mean, I think she's a great person. I think she's really amazing in my view. She's like really just, she's just perfect. <laughs> now it's cliche to say perfect because everyone has like their flaws and everything. But in my view, I mean, she's really, really amazing. And I think it's great that she's actually, um, I don't know if you can hear that in the background, but I really think it's great that she's actually partaking to become, becoming a nurse. And I wish her the best. And yeah, I mean, hopefully we'll be able to to meet in, later in the future, I guess, I'm in person. And when it does happen, I won't regret one bit of it at all. But uh, yeah, 
but I'll be I'll be right back for a bit. Sorry about that. I had to pretty much close the door considering my room is really small. So when you get out of this door, everybody's room is like intact everywhere. It's like mom's room, bathroom, closet, uh, gaming room, computer room, and then my sister's room. So it's just really like cramped in here in a small house. Um, I personally don't mind this house, but the thing is, when I'm older and I want to move out, and uh, I want to be in the, damn it, I want to have my own house to myself. And well, if I find somebody, I probably pre probably did, but um, I want to have like a. That's my thing. I want to have like a big house, like literally a big house, and just like uh, like everything's white. I want it to be all white. And I want, I, want, I like it, I like a white, I don't know why, but I know it's like harder to clean if something gets dirty, but uh, I don't mind. But I want a really big house, um, I want, that's my, that's my um, goals and dreams. But uh, I want a big house, I'm gonna finish my college education, get my good degree job, and then uh, head into my career also. But I'm still gonna be doing my YouTube thing, obviously. So uh, it's, it's like a side job, I guess. Um, I don't think I'd plan to stay too long for UPS because I'd be in college still, obviously, and then I'd finish, then I'd change my career, I mean, change my career, go into my career, start that career, and then quit UPS because I don't want to work there any as much anymore. I, I'm really, like, stressed out with that job. I hate that job. I just, like, I like the YouTube job. That's it. But, um, yeah, that's pretty much, I just, I'm fl I have fluffy hair right now. I need a haircut. Look at that. <laughs> Look at that shit. Because like a mohawk, a small mohawk. But uh, I know this is pretty much being open and honest with you guys. I I'm really open and honest as much as possible. Because if I'm honest with you, I want you guys to at least appreciate that I am like I'm not just like saying all bullshit, but I'm being honest and truthful with you guys. And I think that's something that anyway everyone could take uh, put it to consideration. Because not a lot of people do. Um, but yeah, me personally, though, I'm just right now just chilling. Gonna be drinking my culotta as usual. Mm. Well, I guess iced mocha, really, it's really good. But um, what's out? I still haven't finished my sushi from yesterday, though. I still have like a box left. I still have, like I still have, like eight sushi, and I still got my KFC popcorn chicken I love popcorn chicken but uh yeah <laughs> that's something that I wanted to say I don't I have a lot more videos I should have put on this clip but uh I was gonna put in like all of my extra videos I put I had on my camera on my uh, vlog camera but I'll put it probably in the next vlog so uh I'm gonna I'll talk to you guys later so but uh on a, on a note when it comes to uh you Don because you're watching this video <laughs> um, I just think you're really amazing I think you're really beautiful I like a lot of things about you and I want to get to know you more um, that's the straight honest truth I'm not I'm not like telling this is bullshit or something like that or like I'm just lying about it I'm being truthful with you um, and she knows that I'm really like honest with it so <laughs> I'm, I was pretty open with her with a lot of things on my life and what I think and view on um relationships and everything in general but uh you can guys you guys can check out my tumblr legendary dennis or mark dot tumblr dot com uh i'll probably just leave it in the um it's, it's like gonna be in the links down below in the description i'll probably put it that but uh yeah i hope to talk to you guys later i'm gonna talk to you guys soon actually because it's gonna be a saturday vlog and i'm gonna make the sunday vlog which is today <laughs> but um yeah Anyways, uh, Don, this is really a long video, so <laughs> technically it should be like 40 minutes or more, but um, I got the other clips on the other thing, it's not uploading for some reason, so, oh well, but uh, she wanted to hear what I had to say about her, but I've, I really have more to say about you, but um, I guess I'll like leave it for now, um, yeah, <laughs> um, this, 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 this is it, because when me and Don were talking and Skyping and getting to know each other pretty much, even if it's just for a few days, um, you have that somewhat 
connection with people that you just never thought you would have like I can you click so well and I think that's great though in my view because I clicked with her really well and it, it's like I showed her my personality and she understood my view of it and I understand her point of view as well when it comes to her personality because I, I really like her person I really like it like it's awesome it's fucking awesome because because I told you guys like the intro is like yo you're a butthole and you're a vagina butthole and uh, and all that but um it's it's just like a fun way of expressing yourself it's not it doesn't mean it's like it doesn't have to go towards anything like it doesn't mean anything sexual it doesn't mean anything to be uncomfortable with it's just a fun way of showing who you really are and right now i'm talking to you guys seriously but i'm really a hyper energetic person like hyper and energetic person in real life and uh on camera i, I express myself but this video is really just uh putting my feelings and thoughts across towards dawn so uh yeah, she's gonna watch this video. I know that, <laughs> cause I have to tell. I'm gonna tell her that that's up. But I really don't know how long the video is gonna be like posted. So yeah, I really have like an extra 20 minutes clip to add to this, but it's gonna be really long, so I'm not gonna put that. <laughs> but uh, yeah, she she's just amazing in my view, and I just really do love it, enjoying. I love talking to her a lot. So yeah, but. Comment, subscribe here if you like to share with your friends. If you like the video, why not give it a thumbs up? And I want to hear you guys' opinions on long distance relationships and what's your view on meeting new people and what do you think about your significant other if you want, if you think that. Uh, like, what do you want in your significant other and all that? You can leave it in the comment section below. I'll read it. And um, yeah, hope you guys enjoy the, uh, the day. I'm sorry this is a long video, <laughs> it's just that I really talk a lot. And usually this is, I think this is like the most longest video I've ever made for a vlog. So yeah, my shortest vlog was like less than a minute. So I don't have to worry about that. But um, yeah, talk to you guys later. So yeah, comment, subscribe if you like to share with your friends. Why not give it a thumbs up? Helps me, helps you too. You get updated frequently. And I'll talk to you guys later, you buttholes and vagina buttholes.